Okay. Right here are the cells, or well, one cell anyway, that I'm using. Um, this BMS board is okay, but it's limited to about three or four amps. But this is capable of delivering 30 amps in pulses and uh, six amps normal draw. So what I've been doing is taking these off, but it's not difficult. Lift the uh, negative tab up and then just get behind it and slip the cable as the negative. Okay, now I'll try and show this on camera, but um, might be a little awkward, but anyway, I'll do it anyway. Push out there a bit more, that's better. Right, what I do is I put a big blob where the uh, board is mounted and I wait for it to uh, soften the solder underneath and on the board and away it comes. Right. And once I've done that, then I put it on charge. Now, I'll out on it. And what I do when I put them on charge is just simply got my power supply connected to uh, uh, set up 4.2 and I let, I let it draw whatever amps it wants. Uh, none of these are dead flat so there won't be any 6 amp draw uh, charge and that's uh, charging away at uh, 600 milliamps coming up slowly from uh, 3.7 right so we'll put that to one side and so you know which one I'm doing Now, that will take a few hours to charge, and once it's fully charged, I'll bring you back and take you on to the next section. The printed circuit board that is going to uh, hold all the uh, cells. It just means that um, I only have to sort the. Yeah, I only have to um, solder a piece of um, nickel strip onto the negative here and then that brings me up a tab to connect onto the negative over here on the PCB. Um, I've also brought out the uh, battery neg, battery plus, B1 and B2 so I don't mount the uh, junction here of the nickel strip and uh, there's not, even, not a lot of heat to uh, put on the positive connection. Right, so let's get on with it. I love this uh, flux. It's called No Clean Flux and um, this uh, bottle I... 500 millimeters and um, I can't, no, I can't read the label as to, uh, I think that's light, no clean flux, not sure, but it's 500 millilitre bottle anyway, cost me about 18 quid about four years ago, five years ago, quite some time ago, and uh, I, I use it almost every day, it's brilliant stuff. My friend Patrick in Ireland put me onto it, and um, both of us have had 
no problems with this flux shop driver. Oh, if you buy this, uh, I don't get anything. I'm not uh, affiliated with whoever sells it. Right. <laughs> You'll have to let me know if um, you like this overhead uh, idea. It's um, not awkward for me. It's uh, okay. I'm not going to uh, bore you with uh, watching me do all this. I'll um, bring you back when I finished. You can see the final result. That one looks a bit messy, doesn't it? Come on, Raymond, you can do better than that. There we go. 